So hello everybody, Chloe Lewis here, and in this video I'm going to make all the Sputnik DAOs that the CreateBase community needs for the upcoming uh, Open Web Hackathon in May. <clears throat> so this is the Sputnik DAO platform. Uh, I know many people that are watching this video are like, what the heck is this? It looks really weird. The UI is going to get an update soon, but everything that you need to know is here on the page, I promise. So this is a near DAP, a near application built on the blockchain. So you're going to sign in in the top right hand corner. And I'm using my Chloe.near account because it's not on my ledger. And so it's like my just fun hot wallet. And so I won't have to sign my transaction with the ledger. I can just click the allow button and it will automatic, well, it will sign the transaction and then it'll approve and go back to the DAP. Okay, it'll load all the information. So uh, I want to change this DAO. It automatically went to the DAO I normally go to for create base, but that's not what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to create a new DAO. So I have like a little document here with all these DAOs. I'm just going to copy and paste this information so I don't have to like redo it all. But the DAO name is going to be VR slash DAO and then it's going to be Sputnik DAO near. The purpose of this DAO, I didn't write a general purpose, but it's just going to be something very basic and generic like uh, to support. Actually, we're going to we're going to talk about the hackathon here. Uh, to support bounty payouts for the May Hackathon. Okay, that's all we're going to say for now. I'm actually going to copy and paste this as well. We're just going to put this back in the document at the bottom. Okay, the council. So, one per line. So, we have our council here. So, we are just going to... Down. So natural warp, we have Lewis from Mintbase. Uh, natural warp is a VR artist who's often in insomnium space. And Jilt is a creative dev in the near ecosystem, an artist as well. Uh, we're going to enter a bond. A bond is a amount in near that you must submit with your payout proposal to stop from spam. Because uh, if it was free, you might get a bot submitting a thousand payout proposals and then just spamming the, the UI and spamming the system. So you don't want that. You want to put a little bond in there. And your vote period. For the hackathon, it's going to be 72, 72 hours, three days. This can be changed by a vote from the council. And the grace period, which is not that important. If the period of time, which you can like, uh, if you vote the wrong thing, you can change uh, if you don't want something to pass. Uh, we're going to make that six hours. It really doesn't matter that much. And actually, I realized I'm logged into the wrong account because Chloe.near does not have enough funds for this. But this is going to be fun because I'm going to have to go submit some more funds to Chloe.near. So let's go to wallet.near.org. And then we, cause we can see Chloe.near only has 2.7 near in it. And if you go here, you can see that it takes at least 3.5 near for storage. So we, I have an, wait, do, is my account here? Create based DAO near. So there's a, there's a DAP called Berry Cards and sales from that DAP go to this account, create based DAO near. So this is an account that raises funds for the create based guild on the near ecosystem. So I'm going to send a few of these funds to Chloe.near to get these DAOs started. So we're just going to send, we're starting five DAOs. Let's send 30 near. Um, we'll send the rest of it. Um, actually, let's just send 50 near and we'll send five, 10 near to each DAO. Um, Chloe.near. So this should not take too long. So we are going to take this, you're going to authorize it, confirm the transaction, go through all the same stuff we were doing before. And this part always takes a little bit longer because my internet's not the fastest, but that's okay. Now we'll be able to do this. So we're going to put 10 near into this DAO. We are going to submit it and it should be, I'll have no control over this DAO either. So if I messed up or something like that, whoops, but I have no control over the funds in this DAO. Um, there is 10 near in it and I have zero control, which is kind of cool, right? So it, it always goes back to this one on the UI and so that will change. But if we scroll to the bottom, we'll see, a, we'll see VR, 
uh, dash Dow dot Sputnik Dow dot near. We can view the council and it'll show Jilt, uh, Lewis, I can never pronounce that, Microchip GNU, and Natural Warp. Okay, so we are going to create another one. That was only the first one. We need to create four more. So let's go back to our little document. Let's copy and paste this. Down name is going to be generative art. The purpose is going to be to support bounty payouts. Hackathon. The council is going to be Jordan, who is a near community member. Uh, Rogan X, uh, who is an artist in the near in the Ethereum created crypto ecosystem. And Yesin, YS24, who actually has a generative art platform on the near testnet. The bond, again, is going to be 0.1. You get this bond back after a successful payout proposal. So after, so you pay this 0.1 near with your proposal, and you get it back after your proposal is completed. So if you submit a payout proposal for 5 near, you will get back 5.1 near. Uh, after you've completed your proposal. If you fail, if you're, if the council votes down your proposal, you will lose your point one near, and that's how it deters from spam. Grace period, I think I said 12 hours. It really doesn't matter that much. We're gonna send 10 near, and we are going to submit. I should probably check these input values more than once. Uh, if you wanna check for more information, you can always, uh, oh, they hashed the arguments. Very cool. I never, I've never actually checked. That's terrible, right? Um, anyways, we're going to allow, um, <laughs> I probably should have checked that in the past, what I'm actually signing. You're always have to check what you're actually signing. Um, anyways, transferred successfully. It'll go back to create base DAO. Um, oh, cool. Minted on testnet and shared on socials. Look, someone submitted a, pr a proposal. That's really cool. And they put the government thing right there. We can go check that out later. Anyways, let's change DAO. Let's check it out. Generative art dot Sputnik dot near view council it has ten near in it boom okay next one because we're taking too long to do this stuff uh, NFT onboarding the purpose council Mango Dogwood amazing create based community member works for charged particles now literally an amazing human being in every single way uh what's her toes a latin Ameri a latin artist crypto artist uh wrote a wonderful blog post about buying near from the us for the create based community and jordan once again rounding up this group we got a bond of 0.1 we got a vote period of three days and the bond can be changed not in the ui but it can be changed through cli um, you can just write a little fun little command and do that. Uh, so we have to do that for create base. We have to put it from one near down to 0.1 because one near kind of became a little bit too much. Uh, and we're going to put 10 near in this one as well. Boom. Submit. And we are good to go. Um, allow. And the next one is going to be NFT gaming. Yeah, yeah. Change DAO, create new DAO, NFT gaming. The purpose is going to be to support bounty payouts for the May Hackathon. Uh, the council is going to be Lenara, the other facilitator of the uh, Create Base Guild. And uh, Thor. And I love... Wait, what did I do? I love his... Um, near name. I think my, my favorite near name I have ever seen is Engineer. It's amazing. And then we're only having two for that one for now. And if they want to invite someone else in, they can have a vote to do that. The bond is going to be 0 0.1. The vote period is going to be 72. The grace period is going to be 12. And the amount to transfer is going to be 10. Okay. And again, we'll just do this. Pop. And then the next one is going to be the Near Music Guild. And Dow Records is going to head up that one. And what they are going to be doing is creating a record label on the Near blockchain, a decentralized record label. So 
They are going to be supporting payouts for the hackathon and Dow Records. I'm not even going to type it out. That's how, yeah. Anyways, Dow Records is going to be the only council member and their goal is going to be decide the best way of doing it. So they can decide that having everything down on the forums and then, you know, only having one or say, let's say one or two, seven, two people on the council, they can hire one other CEO. Uh, they can decide to use other types of guilds, other types, sorry, other types of DAOs as well, whatever they want. But the idea is for them to actually work through ideating over how would you have a decentralized record label on the near blockchain that, that's governed and the payouts go through the near blockchain. Uh, grace period, amount of transfer, 10. Let's make sure I spelt everything right. <laughs> that's not, yeah. <laughs> um, Dow records. Why do, I, why do I feel like I can't spell right now? I'm feeling like I spelt that wrong even though I know I spelt it right. Has it ever happened to you where you like you you know you spelled something right but you feel like you spelled it wrong and you're like so what I'm gonna do just to make sure that this is even though this is completely silly and I know that this is how it's spelled I'm still gonna check it in the Explorer because the quickest way to just take away all my anxiety is just to do that there you go submit <laughs> oh gosh don't trust your brain to know how things are spelled. Verify. <laughs> I, growing up, I was a terrible... I, I still am a pretty not that great uh, speller. But growing up, I was a really, really bad speller. Like, really bad. I just didn't care about the way words were spelled. I just cared about the idea. Um, and so... But these are the five. So we have the VR DAO, Generative Art DAO, NFT Onboarding... NFT Onboarding. Sorry about that. NFT Gaming and the Near Music DAO. Awesome! That only took me 12 minutes. Not too bad. And I explained everything as I went through. So now, if you wanted to actually submit a proposal, we can show that on the Create Base DAO. So what that will look like, just for the ending here, is if you selected this, you're going to see... You're going to be able to add a proposal, a payout type. You're going to put a target like Chloe.Near, like we just saw. You're gonna put a job like I did a hackathon ideation uh, bounty. I should say it should be like I did the right like I did the for this for this DAO, and then you can put your forum link here. So you can put your this is the near forum. You can you for create base. This is the create base bounties. So you can go in here. Oh, there's a bounty for showcasing your mint based store. Okay, you can come in here, copy and paste that link. Check, say how much the payout should be, which it'll say right here, five near. And then you get your payout, you submit. <laughs> this is what it'll look like. So I, have, I haven't actually voted on this one yet. So I created my mint based store and shared on Twitter. If we click the forum link in the description of the payout proposal, we will go to the, we will see this is the reply this person put in. I will like it to be like, yeah, that's awesome. And then I will be like, that looks like proof. I could even go to Twitter. I can say, oh, look, and now you're seeing my personal Twitter, but that looks like proof. I'm going to retweet it and be like, wow, they actually did it. Near.mintbase.io. I have proof of the proposal. Now I can come here and I can vote on this proposal as a council member, knowing that this is actually factual information. So during the hackathon, council members will be, use this type of a system uh, to ensure that the payout proposals they're receiving are in, in fact factual. Uh, so yeah, that's a little quick fun video about me set setting up all of the DAOs and that, yeah.